Here's something that is easy to forget for some reason. There are really two kinds of circulation going on in the spleen, open and closed. First, open circulation. Blood flows through the capillaries into the splenic cords, the cords of Billroth, which are basically the filters of the spleen. They consist of a labyrinth of macrophages connected by lung dendritic processes. Once in the cords, blood cells squeeze through the gaps in the cord endothelium to get into the sinusoids. Blood then flows from the sinusoids into the splenic vein and out of the spleen. This process takes time. It's sometimes called the slow compartment and closed circulation. Blood flows from capillaries straight into the splenic veins. That's it. As you can imagine, if you're a blood cell, it's a lot easier to go through the closed circulation. At any point in time, only a small percentage of the blood is traveling through the open circulation, but in any 24-hour period, all the blood manages to make it through the cords at least once. To read more, see Robin's 9th edition, page 623.